Good morning, everybody, and welcome to today's devotion for June 4th. Today's devotion is titled, My Father's Child, and the Bible reading is from John chapter 14, verses 8 to 14. Philip said, Lord, show us the Father, and that will be enough for us. Jesus answered, Don't you know me, Philip, even after I have been among you such a long time? Anyone who has seen me has seen the Father. How can you say, show us the Father? Don't you believe that I am in the Father and that the Father is in me? The words I say to you, I do not speak on my own authority. Rather, it is the Father living in me who is doing his work. Believe me when I say that I am in the Father and that the Father is in me, or at least believe on the evidence of the works themselves. Very truly, I tell you, whoever believes in me will do the works I have been doing, and they will do even greater things than these because I am going to the Father. And I will do whatever you ask in my name so that the Father may be glorified in his Son. You may ask me for anything in my name, and I will do it. They looked down at the faded photograph, then up at me, then over at my father, then back at me, then back at my father. Their eyes were as wide as the proverbial saucer. Dad, you look just like Papa when he was young. My father and I grinned because this was something we'd known for a long time, but it wasn't until recently that my children came to the same realization. Well, my father and I are different people. In a very real sense, to see me is to see my father as a younger man, tall, lanky frame, full head of dark hair, prominent nose, and rather large ears. No, I am not my father but I am most definitely my father's son. A follower of Jesus named Philip once asked, Lord, show us the father. And while it wasn't the first time Jesus had indicated as much, his response was still cause for pause. Anyone who has seen me has seen the father. Unlike the physical resemblances between me and my father, what Jesus says here is revolutionary. Don't you believe that I am in the Father and that the Father is in me? His very essence and character were the same as his Father's. In that moment, Jesus was being straightforward with his beloved disciples and us. If you want to know what God is like, look at me. What are some of the characteristics of Jesus and the Father that resonate strongly with you and why? How has he been molding your character? Thank you for joining me for today's devotion and I hope you all have a wonderful day.